Welcome to Health Pop, your look at top health stories. Today, a pill to prevent gray hair, chicken pox lollipops, and slower traffic, slower brain. First up, dying from the inside out. Cosmetics maker L'Oreal reveals that company scientists are developing a once a day pill to prevent gray hair. As we age, hair pigment cells die off, causing hair to turn gray. The good news is that there's a natural enzyme that halts this process. L'Oreal's pill contains a fruit extract that mimics the enzyme. Safety studies are underway, and if the pill proves safe, it could be on the market by 2015. But if you can't wait until 2015, you could always try my twice a week method for removing gray hair, though admittedly, it's not for everybody. Next up, chicken pox lollipops. A great way to get your kids sick if it wasn't illegal. I think perhaps the parental paranoia surrounding the dangers of childhood vaccinations is getting a little out of hand. The latest trend in the anti-vaccination world is buying and selling lollipops licked by kids with chicken pox. Yeah, it's gross, but apparently it's appealing to parents who prefer that their children build a natural immunity to the disease. Listen up, parents. Doctors say these lollipops likely won't pass the pox to your kids, though if you're considering this, you probably don't pay much attention to what doctors say anyways. And beware, the same law that makes it a crime to mail anthrax pertains to chicken pox. Mailing the candy is a federal offense that could land you up to 20 years in jail. Finally, the effects of traffic pollution on brain health. The Wall Street Journal reports that scientists are trying to determine if exposure to traffic exhaust can damage your brain. A growing number of studies suggest that car and truck fumes may heighten the risk of Alzheimer's and autism and speed the effects of Parkinson's disease. Other research shows that high exhaust levels can even leave a molecular mark on the genome of a newborn for life. Think about that the next time you leave your car idling. That's your health pop. I'm Nick Dietz, CBSNews.com.